How's it going everyone? The Minty Badger here bringing you another Funko Pop review and this time it is my favourite character uh, from the Game of Thrones and as you can quite plainly see it is Sandor Clegane otherwise known as the Hound. Uh, so this guy is literally my favourite character ever. Uh, I, I just I don't know what it is about him. I think it's just his attitude and like just the way he just does not give a damn. Uh, so yeah, I get really attached to this character. I think he's amazing, and uh, I'm going to review him here today for you guys. Uh, so yeah, let's take a quick look at the box. We have Pop Game of Thrones number five. A uh, little picture of him down here, the Hound. Uh, on the side we have a full picture of him. Uh, the usual stuff. Here we have the Hound again. Little picture of him up top. Down here we have all the usual stuff you need to get in contact with Funko and on the back <coughs> we have uh, the rest of the characters from edition 1. Uh, so I've already seen on the channel Tyrion and Daenerys and the White Walker I think. I'm not sure if the White Walker's out yet actually, maybe he is. Uh, but the only ones I don't have in this set are Ned Stark and uh, Khal Drogo. So yeah, I'm hoping to get them very soon. So yeah, uh, the Hound, he is from the Clegane house, House of Clegane, <coughs> which um, the the sigil for that is the three uh, hounds in uh, ascending order uh, with a yellow background. Uh, his brother is uh, Gregor Clegane, otherwise known as the Mountain. I do have a review of him coming up pretty soon. Uh, but yeah, just a little backstory to the house, guys, in case you didn't know. So, on the side here, uh, on the side of his face, first of all, let's get to that. Uh, we have his well known scar, and this is why he mainly gets called the Hound because of the way he looks. Uh, we find out that, not really a spoiler, but he talks about it pretty early on. We find out that that mark on his face uh, was um, basically. <coughs> Inflicted on him by his uh, by his brother, uh, the Mountain Gregor Clegane, uh, because he pushed his uh, face against the fire. I think it was because he stole one of his toys or something like that. That's why uh, the Mountain did that to him. Uh, but yeah, he's got a pretty dim look in his face, pretty fed up look. That is the usual way he looks in the show. Uh, his little beard, uh, his hair, pretty standard. Uh, we come down to his armor. He rarely ever changes this. Uh, armor. I don't think uh, he really changes it at all. Uh, not that I I can remember. If he does, please comment down below, guys, and remind me uh, of the episode. But I have seen up to season five. I have finished it for now. Uh, so yeah, uh, he's got his little sword, which is quite nice. Uh, I really I I wanted them to do a variant of this guy where. Uh, it was this one and sort of like a second one where he had his sort of like Clegane helmet on, sort of a hound helmet, because uh, that'd been pretty awesome. Uh, that'd be a sick little pop. But you never know, they may do one still. Uh, so yeah, we have his sword and his armor's pretty nice as well. It's sort of that uh, grey metallic colour. And then we have the sort of strong metallic silver and some black thrown in there for his... Uh, uh, his leather straps and things like that, but yeah, really awesome little figure. Um, really do like the character of the Hound. Uh, the Mountain's pretty awesome, but the Hound sort of uh, sells it for me. I just think he's really hilarious, uh, some of the things he says. And he's a really good fighter as well, which is a plus. So, yeah guys, the Hound, uh, otherwise known as Sandor Clegane. So I hope you enjoyed this little review guys and I hope you enjoyed that little sort of insight into the Clegane family uh, because it's one of my favourite houses from the show even though we don't sort of hear a lot about it uh, we only really hear it through the, the two brothers but yeah guys I hope you enjoyed so if you did remember to give me a thumbs up, give it a little like, it's always appreciated uh, subscribe also uh, if you want to keep up to date, my upload days are Monday, Wednesday, Friday so there's always new videos on the channel uh, you can also share the video and you can go over and check out the Mini Badger Facebook page and Twitter. You can like the page and follow me on Twitter uh, because I do post sort of little uh, different things, uh, little sneak peeks and things like that to let you guys know what is going on. So yeah guys, I hope you're having a wonderful day and until the next Funko Pop review or video that I do, thank you for tuning in and goodbye.